Hey YouTubers, it's Shelly here. Well, something that caught my attention was about the new purge law that's happening in Illinois for January 1st, 2023. I know a lot of us are wondering, is this really going to happen? Or is this some sort of scam? Well, I wrote down a little couple of things that I wanted to discuss with you. That, <clears throat> first of all, we don't want none of this to happen out there or in California or anywhere else, you know, in the world. So, this is one of the most controversial laws I've seen passed in decades. Some are, re re you know, referring to it as the purge law. But... What does it really represent as a movie? In the movie, a rich family was taken hostage. They had 24 hours to do what they wanted with these people. But in reality, do we really think that's going to happen and they would let that law pass? So I did a little more research and... It's called the Safety Act. To be specific, there are 12 non-detainable offenses where there's a new law would end the cash bail. And let me go ahead and read some of those to you. It says second degree murder. Also arson, drug-induced homicide robbery, kidnapping, aggravated battery, burglary, intimidation, aggravated driving under the influence, fleeing and evading, drug offenses, and threatening a public official would non-detainable. So now we gotta think. Should we all be prepared just in case it does happen? I think so. Just to be on the safe side. Always protect your loved ones no matter what. This way, if it really does give the red flag to go ahead and do this. I know myself personally, I would have my house ready for the 20, you know, uh, um, 2023. Just in case the law does go by that. They're not going to say, oh, yeah, we're passing it. But basically, if you go and read these laws that they're letting them get away with for the meantime, then anything can be possible. You never know what can happen. So I say protect your loved ones. Take it as, yes, they are approving the purge because they're not going to strictly say it. Yeah, we are. Just go ahead and protect your family. That's what I would do. Also, you guys got to be safe out there regardless of January. Always have your eyes open and be prepared for anything before January. It could be just a sneaky trick. It could be lies. It could be made up stories. We never know. But I know I would take it serious and hopefully it doesn't go through. And it's just for certain offenders and charges but they only got 48 hours to detain them. So just prepare yourselves and let all your loved ones know. And we'll keep you updated if we hear any more. And if you hear anything, please comment below. Let us know also for we can all have each other's backs, you know, because the government is not going to tell us nothing. So we all got to stick together as a human race. So... Go ahead and like and subscribe to my channel and I'll keep you updated as well as you guys do the same for me. Thank you.